What's going on, mi gente? Casper Martinez, latinofilmchatter.com. I want to read a comment from Maria Nieto. She posted it on my wall uh, talking about the last video that I put up about the New York International Latino Film Festival. And uh, it really, really breaks down how I'm feeling, and I'm glad that she wrote it. And I'm going to read it to you guys in this video so you could, so you could hear some of the stuff that we're trying to say here and see how our message is not really that crazy. So Maria, Maria Nieto says, it comes down to this, and all Latino film festival is the diversity effort. We don't need to div diversify anymore. So that's the first thing she says. It comes down to this, and all Latino film festival is the diversity effort. It's there to give the exposure and growth opportunities that we don't receive in the mainstream filmmaking community. It's supposed to be our little corner of the industry where we get to hear our stories, see our people, and learn more about the craft of filmmaking from others who share our unique struggle. When you dilute that, you make our limited playing field even smaller. Every Latino can submit to a mainstream film festival in this country and be one of many submissions. The whole point of an all Latino film festival is to give us the unique opportunity to see where we're at, to be measured against the work of others in our community so that we can identify trends, meet our new rising stars, and learn from each other within the context of what it means to be a Latino filmmaker. The African American community has the American Black Film Festival now in its 14th year, and their mission statement and commitment remains the same. At no point, and I'm, uh, I'm skewing away from what she wrote, <clears throat> at no point the American Black Film Festival is going, we want to be inclusive. We want to show that all other ethnicities can work with us. We want to show how it's evolving. No, they're actually sticking to their mission. Let's get back to, to what they're saying. The American Black Film Festival is dedicated to strengthening the black filmmaking community through resource sharing, education, artistic collaboration, and career development. The ABFF was born out of the need to develop distribution opportunities for independent black films and promote cultural diversity within the motion picture industry. In, a, in a addition, they too have HBO as a sponsor of a short film award. In order to participate in this contest, they clearly state that your submission must be written and or directed by a person of African descent. I don't see any evidence of this festival wavering in its laser focus of advancing the careers and opportunity of the community they represent. Why then should we as Latinos demand any less from those who are entrusted with our stories? The term Latino can't just apply when it comes to tapping into the diversity budgets of corporate sponsors. I completely agree with that. And that's what really bothers me here too, is that the Latino Film Festival says, hey, we're the Latino Film Festival to corporate sponsors. And then to the rest of the world, they, they go, well, we are the Latino Film Festival, but come on, come on. You know there's more than Latinos out there, right? You know that he at the festival, you know, we have our own little cliques. You know we're going to do our hookups. You know we're going to take care of our people. And that's what's been happening here. Mira, the New York International Latino Film Festival is letting their volunteers and their little homies run shit at the festival. Because you are okaying the Linda McRae's, the Ephraim Benton, to use the banner of New York International Latino Film Festival for self-gratification and self-promotion. And of course, the argument here could be, well, come on, Casper, I'm Linda McCray and I'm just trying to look out for my peoples and I'm trying to share with everyone. That's all bullshit because no other company lets themselves run that way. The American Black Film Festival wouldn't be cool with me doing a, a Latino night in, in the Bronx. They will be like, okay, if you're going to do that, we're going to tell you what's okay to put out there because it's our brand and we have to take care of our brand. It seems like the New York International Latino Film Festival's brand is all over the place. 
Linden, you edit for us. You really don't get paid shit. Do whatever you want with it. Hey, Ephraim, last year you won Best Film again. Uh, do whatever the hell you want with the brand. It's cool. Uh, I'm Calypso Chinchilla, and I'm the executive director, but it's really Elizabeth who's running this. Like, people, what's with all the smoke and mirrors? When are any of you going to have some balls and say, look, we get it. We hear you, Casper. We hear uh, all you Latinos that are, that are saying what you're saying. We might not feel the same way, and this is why we don't feel that the same way. We don't hear that. All we get is bullshit trailers that Lyndon puts with his little, well, we're skewing toward the international side, and then little postings they put on the Latino Film Festival saying, hey, we're trying to be risque and innovative. Esto, all right? Let's, let's call it what it is, people. You guys are playing with the Latino brand. You're being questioned about it, and you don't want to answer to Latinos about why you're taking the Latino brand and doing whatever the fuck you want with it. Not cool. Not cool, New York International Latino Film Festival. You guys are whack.